Hello, good evening, and welcome to another episode of Expedition Unreasonable. I am your host, Dickie McFaquinkle. I have advanced degrees in cryptomorphic zoology and hillwalking. And I have spent much of the last few years seeking out the unknown, the unexpected, and even the totally unreasonable. I do it so that you don't have to. On tonight's episode, we'll be searching for perhaps one of the most incredible cryptid life forms known throughout all of history, the unicorn. But what exactly is a unicorn, anyway? The unicorn is a legendary creature, one that has been described since antiquity as a beast with a single, large, spiralling horn projecting from its forehead. It was depicted in ancient seals of the Indus Valley civilization and was mentioned by the ancient Greeks in accounts of natural history. And in European folklore, the unicorn is often depicted as a white, horse-like animal with a single long horn. The unicorn. Magical, mysterious, and yet oddly familiar. But do they really exist? My crew and I travelled to the beautiful ancient city of Dundee, Scotland. Now it is a modern European city, and since the 1980s it has been known as the city of Disco. But for many hundreds of years, Dundee has in fact been the global epicentre of unicorn sightings. Even today, there are unicorns everywhere. Here we have HMS Unicorn. Built in 1824, she is nearly 200 years old. And yes, they also have dragons. But that's a story for another day. Here we have another unicorn in what the locals call the city square. Awesome! Here, atop this large pillar and plinth, another unicorn casts its gaze over the bustling city centre. In the Middle Ages and Renaissance, the unicorn was commonly described as an extremely wild woodland creature and a symbol of purity and grace. Its horn was said to have the power to heal sickness, kind of like the rhinoceros today. So how do we go about finding one? Well, we contacted Lachlan Dovakin, Dundee Denizen and the world's foremost unicorn expert. Hello Lachlan, I'm Richard. My friends call me Dickie. Pleased to meet you. Hi Dickie, the pleasure's mine. Right. Let's get right to it. Unicorns. Are they real? Yes, they are, and the evidence is everywhere. Certainly the historical evidence is plentiful, but in recent times, or at least since the invention of the video camera, surely there would be video footage of one. Well, that's a good question, but there's a few reasons why that's not so. One, they're very shy creatures, and they're sensitive to sound and smell, making them almost impossible to track. And two, they only come out during the daytime, so night vision thermal goggles and such are of no use when hunting them. I see. So, how are we going to go about finding one? <laughs> Sorry, allergies. You'll need local knowledge and current information as to their habits and whereabouts. Right, so uh, where do we start? In Balgay Park. There have been numerous sightings there, some as recently as last week. Wow, that's amazing! Let's go, there are some folks you should meet. Lay on, Macduff, as they say. So, oh, this is the place? Yes, about 80% of all unicorn sightings are about here. Amazing! This place has such a feel to it. So ancient. Almost as if... As if you're being watched. 
Exactly. It's giving me goosebumps. I will do that. When was the most recent sighting? Just a couple of weeks ago. Oh, right. I'd like to introduce you to some folks I've been in contact with. Both are survivors of unicorn encounters. Wow! Both encountered a unicorn? Yes, on separate occasions and quite recently. I've asked them to meet me up by the observatory. Amazing! We're going to meet two people that have both had unicorn encounters. And hopefully they can tell us what we need to know so we can have one as well. Can't wait. Hi. This is Angelique. Angelique Boulevard de Grizz. So pleased to meet you. And? Jumbo. My mates call me Jumbo. Jumbo? Is that a Scottish name? No, man. It's Swahili. Ken. Because I'm on the Swahili. Of course, Jambo is Swahili for hello. Here you go, learning stuff, eh? <laughs> so you've both had unicorn encounters? I did, I did, hey, and couldn't have been uniform, eh? Amazing! What can you tell me about it, uh, Angelique? Well, it wasn't far from here, actually. Really? Oh, yeah. It's just over there, in fact. Yeah, there's a lovely bridge just over there. It's a well-known hotspot for unicorns. Oh, yes. I was just walking home, and as I was passing under the bridge, there it was. Amazing! You saw it? Up close? I, I nearly choked on my cheeseburger. You were eating a cheeseburger? I'd just taken a bite, and when I looked up, it was staring right at me. It was beautiful. I, I think it wanted my burger, though. Oh, they love cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers? Yeah, they just can't get enough of them. It's a well-known fact. Wow. Well, I threw my burger at it, and it scooped it up. And boom! Like that, it was gone! That is just... That's just how it goes with these creatures. They're very skittish and will bolt just like that. Scarves! So, Jambo, how did it happen with you? How did what happen? The unicorn, you muppet. When you saw the unicorn. <laughs> the unicorn. No, the unicorn, aye. Tell him what you told me, Jambo. It was the sound. The sound of the unicorn. That's what it was. It made a sound? Uh, just before I uh, saw it, I uh, heard it. And I smelled it. Wow. And how did it smell? Like a cheeseburger, eh? That makes sense. And the sound? I'll not forget the sound. It, it haunts us, eh? It, it's, it's what drove us to the drink. And it drove him to the drink. It's a very distinctive sound. In fact, I have a unicorn call right here. Oh, that's great. And we can use this to call one, right? Absolutely, that's the plan. Oh my god, that sound. Aye, the sound, that sound, I'll never forget that sound, it's in my head, it's in my head. Wow, there was a wee flash of colour in the place was it did. He means the graveyard, over the bridge. Unicorns love graveyards, and that's why they only come out during the day. Thank you so much. It's our pleasure, really, it is such an honour. Thank you so much for your time. Cheers, guys. Well, it looks like we've come to the right place. We have personally heard eyewitness testimonies and, incredible as it may seem, a unicorn appears to stalk these woods. We know what it sounds like, we know what it likes to eat, and we know approximately where it hunts. Now let's see if we can find one. We should try the bridge. That's a good place to start. Excellent! 
This is brilliant. This is why I got into this business. I've also brought several cheeseburgers along with me, so hopefully we can lure it out. Brilliant. Lead on. So, Lachlan, what do you think of our chances to actually find a unicorn today? Well, Dickie, we shouldn't get our hopes up too much, but I say our chances are pretty decent. Here we are, the bridge. Wow, what now? Well, first we lay out some bait. This cheeseburger can go right here. Wow, what now? Now we wait. Perhaps we should try the call. I think we should. We have to be kind of like this. Shh. It's getting closer. Right here. Did we get it? You sure? Damn. It's there. It's just up there. It's gone. Check the burger. It's taking the cheeseburger. This is amazing. It's clearly highly intelligent. Well, we can still track it. It's probably somewhere nearby, feeding. Let's get it. Freeze, don't move. Look down at your foot. Oh dear. Slowly step back, careful. Incredible! Is, is that what I think it is? Absolutely. We've found fresh unicorn shit. In fact, I almost stepped in it. It's still warm. It must be near. <laughs> you smell that? Cheeseburgers? Yes. <laughs> this way. Come on. Take a look at this. Half a cheeseburger. It's close. Unicorns are very, uh, oh, skittish. I think it went this way.
can't just see it through the trees. Try get some footage of it. I have a camera, if my uh, cameraman would be so kind. Thank you. Focus. There we go. Achoo! Sorry. Damn, it's gone. I think I got something. I am so sorry. Once we're back in the studio and our footage is processed, zoomed and enhanced, we may finally have the evidence that the world has been waiting for. Thank you, Lachlan, for all of your help. You're very welcome. Please let me know what you find. This could be huge. We certainly will. I, for one, can't wait to find out. Well, here we are back in the studio. Our quest to find an actual unicorn was both surprising and eventful. We've met experts and witnesses, and we've learned so much about these incredible creatures. But did we get the footage to prove once and for all that unicorns actually exist? Well, I think I should let you, the audience, be the judge of that. Good night and roll the tape. Achoo!